Hello everyone, it is Hyperverse and so welcome back to another episode of Boom Beach and today what we're gonna be doing is trying to take down the new Colonel Gayhart which has increased wards so that's going to be totally interesting hopefully they actually swapped up their base a little tiny bit as well but let's take a look and see what this Colonel Gayhart is all about so as you guys can see at the left top corner there's the reward thresholds instead of 4 the right now are 7 starting with 2 gears then 5, 10, 20, 40, 65 and 150 and look at how much iron you're able to get from this base. I mean, I'm able to get uh, almost, I think a million or so, almost uh, a million iron. Uh, that's totally insane. Uh, so we're going to definitely try to make that happen because I can use the resources uh, for sure. I'm going to try to use the warrior attack strategy for this base. Now, I kind of need to get used to the new sniper towers and everything like that. So uh, that's something to look at right now. Um, so the way we're going to be doing this is I think it doesn't even matter which way I'm going to be walking because we're using the warriors now anyway. So I think I want to be going from the, um, from the, uh, from the left side here. I'm going to be using this factory supplies to make my way up to the headquarters just like so. Because it's very close at the shore. And I don't really need to worry too much about the, the walking path. So I, I kind of assume that we're able to make it up to the headquarters relatively easily. Then on top of that we got a, we got a variety of uh, defenses we got to take into consideration. You got some rocket launchers over there. But honestly I can potentially... I think if I... I'm not... I don't think I'm able to get all four of them with one shock. I might be able to, if I do it very precise, but it, requ it would require me a lot of time to actually do that. Sorry, my throat feels kind of sore. Uh, and I'll be presenting you guys with a little update video as well, uh, talking about the new update. Because I did a whole video about that, but I kind of want to release this one first, you know. So, uh, then what's left to do is essentially using four shocks... To getting rid of, uh, for example, the flamethrowers or the machine gun. Or maybe I'm going to be using three of them, three shocks. And then use a lot of med kits to kind of make sure that happens. And then also probably use some critters to distract uh, some of the buildings out there. Um, how about we just go ahead and take these to the test to see how well we're going to be doing. But of course, before we get started, I want to be boosting up some stuff. I really don't want to be messing up today. So I'm going to be going full boost with everything. Um... Oh, this is interesting. Resource reward. Uh, this time around, I'm not going to be doing that because I'm going to have overflow of iron pretty badly right now. So, um, let me see if I get, get the right one. This one. Gunboat energy. Uh, troop health. So, I got troop damage, troop health, and gunboat energy. I think we're good to go when it comes down to that. Uh, and we're just going to see how well we're going to be doing. Here we go. So, what I want to be doing here is... Um, Actually, maybe because there's... Okay, hold up. Give me a second here. So, I want to be getting some... I want to be getting some critters in here, actually. Getting rid of all those regular mines. Hopefully, that's going to be fine. Ah, oh, there's one boom mine there. But, you know, that's going to be okay. Um, then, I want to be getting a barrage right around here. I could have done the other side, actually, now I'm thinking about it. But, you know what? It's okay, we cleared it all out, that's most important right now. So that being said, let's actually go ahead and make our way up there. We're going to be using the warriors to uh, kind of make our way up there just like that. Um, actually, I just realized I don't need the triangle smoke to make it up there. It is that the shock blaster is hitting us, but not for a whole lot. Right now making our way up to the headquarters. Not getting... Oh, I, I spoke a little bit too soon. I was going to say not getting exposed at all, but I was totally wrong there. I apologize. Then, let me see. Okay, so I kind of feel good about this right now. I got both, uh, I got all of the shock thingies. And uh, we are doing about one third of the damage. Yeah, we actually did a little bit more than one third. So hopefully, if I do this a little bit better in the next one, I'm going to be able to take this one down. So let's actually go ahead and try this one out. I <clears throat> actually feel a little bit better uh, confident when it comes down to Gearheart right now. So I don't need to worry too much about the rest uh, when it comes down to, um, to shocking. So this little path over here, all of these four, are actually a little bit tricky. So instead of um, doing it the other way that I just did, I'm going to be attempting to drop one shock in between these shock launchers. Hopefully getting these machine guns as well. 
uh, and of course getting the shock blaster but not hitting my own warriors and then I'm gonna be uh, deploying another shock right here getting these buildings and potentially this one if I do it right and then also trying to get this machine gun these two flamethrowers and this machine gun with a third shock and then the only thing that will potentially hit me is this machine gun over there but you know we can handle that so that being said let's actually go ahead and try that one out as well and uh, hopefully we're gonna be able to take it down like I've had so many failures on Gearheart it's actually insane, I'm not even kidding. So two smokes is enough to make our way up there safe and sound. I mean, we're gonna be healing ourselves up through the power of the medkit anyway, so that's going to be alright. Then the warriors are kind of walking right now, they're walking, walking, they're walking perfectly right there. So I'm pretty happy with that. So right now I need to make sure that I shock the correct things here. So that one over here, one over here, one over here. I'll get some critters over there, medkits all around. And... I think I did it very nicely. Look at this. We're doing, we're having a very awesome run on this one, and I very much like it. And dropping a barrage on there from so, for some additional damage onto the headquarters. Now this is where things are going to be pre pretty interesting. There needs to be happening a miracle for me not to take down this base. But before we get onto that, I actually want to check out something. I want to check out my damage here. So the uh, barrage is doing 11,000, and then some artilleries. I'm gonna be doing 5,000. Now the reason why I'm checking that is because I maybe want to be finishing off with an amazing final here. And I think I'm gonna be able to do it. We need some troops first. Oh, of course. We might as well just get the warriors back. Just in case, you know. But we're gonna try to do it this way. And the way I'm talking about is actually the awesome way. I'm gonna be destroying Gearheart with only gunboat energy here. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Da, 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 da. Yeah, there you go. We took it out. Nice. Oh, it actually shows what reward thresholds you're reaching. That is awesome. And then, of course, the final reward threshold is going to be reached as well. We took out Colonel Gearheart, and the lonely survivors are the critters. There we go. Oh my god, look at that iron. That's ridiculous. And of course, the prototype modules. But a million iron from this one. That is very nice. That's going to be doing it for this episode of Boom Beach. I hope that you guys... Oh, what the... Did you just see that commander? <laughs> he was spooling the most amazing face in the history of Boom Beach. Oh my days. I wish I could have... I wish I didn't skip through it. I thought it was the same dialogue. Apparently... They have changed. You want to be taking a look at that. I wish you guys the best of luck on taking down your Colonel Gearheart. I really hope that you guys thoroughly enjoyed that episode. And that being said, make sure you guys stay tuned a little bit later today. Hey, there's a parrot over here. Make sure you guys stay tuned a little bit later today with my thoughts and my opinions about the update. My first impression and so on and so forth. And that being said, uh, once again, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, make sure that if you guys like this video, to boom, give it a thumbs up. Oh, my throat is... My voice is killing me. That being said, this has been Reversal for Boom Beach. I'm going to be signing off and I'll see you guys in the next one.